a very good day to Angel Megat and all my fellow friends and to who are watching this video. My name is Lee Gomin. Today I'm going to present my video tutorial assignment for my artificial intelligence of river crossing puzzle. So what is a river crossing puzzle? A river crossing puzzle is a type of puzzle in which the object is to carry items from one river bank to the another, usually in the fewer type strips. And the difficulty of this puzzle may be arise from the restrictions on how many objects can be carried at the same time and also how many objects are safely left together. As for my example question which is a river crossing, wolf, goat and carrots, the rules are we need to send all wolf, wolf goat and carrots to the opposite river bank, only the farmer and at most one items or object are allowed in the boat for each crossing. This is because only the farmer is able to operate the boat. But we do not leave the goat alone with the carrots or the wolf unsupervised with the goat. This is the wolf, farmer, goat and carrots. As wolf represented by using labu, farmer is F, goat is represented by G, carrot is C and also the river represented by slash. For the initial state, farmer, wolf and goats and carrots are at the left side of the river bank, which is represented by the tuple of WFGC and the slash. For our goal state, we need to send all these items or objects to the opposite side of the river banks, represented by slash WFGC. For the path cost for this crossing, which is one per unit step. As for our actions and ancestors, successors fact function, the boat can carry two objects but only the farmer, farmer can operate the boat, therefore only an object can be aboard with, uh, with the farmer. If you want to move an um, object from the left side to the rear bank, it must stay along with the farmer, which is WFGC slash becomes WC slash FG, or maybe uh, CG slash WF as long as there's a F on the right side. And also, if we want to move an object from the right side of the river bank, we also need the farmer as well to operate the boat. So, if it turns out like WC slash FG equals to, uh, goes to WC slash FG, uh, sorry, slash G. And for our unsuccessful action, which is we leave the wolf and goat, and the goat and carrot are not allowed to stay on the side of the river without the supervised or the existence of the farmer. This is a solution for our river crossing. As from this river crossing, as you can see, there's a different kind of layer, which is a initial state, and then this is our first step, second step, and third step, and so forth. This is for our layer. Okay. And now, I'm going to present the deep first search method. The deep first search method is it will try the method deeply down, which is which is deeply down. And maybe they will start with the first method, which is found out, is failed. Then we'll proceed to the second one, and maybe to the third one. If the third one is success. It will not go into the fourth one at the same time. It will go to deeply down here. And when it finds this method is correct, this method will not try first because it will go through proceed this method, which is it will try the second uh, this layer and then try this method. And if this method is correct, it will proceed to this one. If this one is not correct, it will send to this one. If this one is correct, it will go to this one. Therefore, sometimes in a deep first search method, at the first solution, it will skip a few of the solution until it finish this. The deep first search will continue with this method. If it's not, it's not correct, the deep first search will Continue with this one, and then this one, and just now this one have already gone. It is correct. Then it will try to go to this one. 
and then it will start to find out is this correct no and then it will go to this one then it's find out is this correct no it will go to this one this is the deep first search algorithms and also the method okay now I'm going to show a video about the this method Now I'm going to present the different search AI. Firstly, starting with the first step, the AI will try with different ways. Starting with a carrot, it found out its fails. Then go for the goat, it found out its success. Therefore, this deep search AI will continue to find uh, the, continue, the next step for this uh, step. And then the next step will be it picking up a carrot or either move and send it back to here. And then this AI will uh, try to pick up back to the world, but it seems failed. Therefore, it will start continuing back to this goat step method, which it found correct, and then send it back to here. And switch to the goat. And then back to here, uh, the AI will decide to choose whether it should let. Uh, the goat stay with the wolf or not. If it let it go, stay with the wolf, it fails, then the air will continue to start with the same method again. Just send the goat, pick up the carrot, send it back, switch up the goat. But this time, it will switch up the goat with the wolf and send it back to here. And then it will continue to lift the wolf and the goat together uh, and the carrot together and bring back the goat and success this is the deep first search uh, for the AI as this video mentioned which is same as the point that I mentioned which is this one uh, the AI will start with this two method first and then go for this one and it lifted it this one without knowing after this it will go to this one and this one and leave it this one alone and it will try if this one is it correct no and we go for this one and is it this one correct no and go for this one and continue this is a method for the deep search search AI and after the first round this is the first method then we start to For the second one, which is the second one, you will start to try this one. Is it this one correct? No. Therefore, you will go back to this one and go to this one. Just now we have tried this one, so is this correct? Then we it's time you will go for this one and try for this one, this one, and then it's not this one. This is the deep first search uh, method. And now I'm going to present about the breadth first search method. Unlikely uh, brief different search method, the breadth first search method is go breadthly, as the name says. So the breadth first search method will try uh, this one. The first one, is it success? No. Second one, is it success? No. The third one, is it success? Yes. But it won't continue to the next step until it tries this one. Is it success? No. Then it will secondly go to this step. And after try this step, uh, it will go to the next step, which is this one. Is this success one? Yes. But deep, if for the deep first search, it will go down directly. But not for breath. Breath will try the last another one. Until they try all the lay each layer is complete. This is for the breath first search method. Now I'm going to show you uh video about this breakfast search method now I'm going to present the breakfast search for the AI starting with the farmer because the farmer only farmer can operate the boat the farmer will try with the uh, various kind of method the carrot is not correct and then try it with the gold it found out that the goal is correct, but it won't continue to the next step, but it will start over again and then find a move. 
and if found out the wolf is not correct, then it will continue back to the goat. And when he send the goat back to here, the farmer will this will back to here again and decided to send the carrot or the wolf. Since like the carrot is success, but the farmer uh, the AI won't continue the next step, but it will back to the previous step by selecting the wolf and it found out that the wolf also is a correct way. And then continue by here the uh, AI going to proceed with the two step which is the that's not the previous step which is after selecting the carrot going to here leave it here and then it will come back to the uh, goat here same same back here this is the second uh, the third or the fourth step already at this time it seems like it is a success way but the breakfast AI yeah, will continue with the previous step again which is this time is select the wolf together with the uh, goat together and if also this step is also the correct way okay. right now back to the previous step which is the goat here carrot switch with the goat back to here and then this time it will start to switch with the wolf it seems that it's correct and then the step repeat again this step will continue repeat and repeat again this time we select the wolf then this one is also correct this one is also correct therefore continue to the next step which is the goat and the carrot again then this is a success way as we can see this is a success way from the last, last time and this time it also tries that the first step back to here with a wolf say back to here goat carrot and this step also is correct that means that that is has a various way to continue uh, to get the result so uh, success this is for the breath first search as from the, this video we can see that uh, the method is goes like this which is we try this one this one and then this one and then we try another this one try again and get this one get this one this is the first step second third and fourth it will keep trying all the methods layer by layer this is the breakfast method for unlearning for the differences differences is going down there's this uh, method for the breakfast search and for the question session why do I choose, choose this puzzle because this puzzle is old but classic the level can be increased by adding the restriction which allow the AI to have more discovered in this puzzle and which method is the best for this puzzle actually there is no uh, the best method for this puzzle this is because the different search will find the answer the first answer correctly but the breakfast search will find all the answers at the same time. And then for my reference, I will attach at the description. Thank you for watching my video.